Hi, this is Jeremy Vitto with JJ Power Sports. In this video, what we're going to talk about is anti theft devices that will keep your scooter from getting stolen. Now, scooter theft is a huge problem. It seems like the more scooters we get in the marketplace, the more people want to steal them. And unfortunately, it's not too difficult to steal a scooter. So if you've done any kind of research at all, you've probably noticed there are tons of different devices out there to help your scooter from getting stolen. You've got you know, cables, you've got locks for the wheels, you've got alarms, you've got locks for your steering wheel. I just saw the other day there's you know, locks that go on the grip of your scooter so they can't you know, use the gas. There's all different kinds of these anti-theft devices. But the real question is, which one will work the best? Which one will keep your scooter the safest? Now. If I could only use one device, I would pick the scooter alarm. The reason I like the scooter alarm is it makes noise. None of these other devices make any noise at all. So here's a quick example. Let's say it's nighttime, you've got your scooter tied to you know, a gate, you've got your cable lock on it or your wheel lock, you know, nobody can move your scooter. But if somebody comes along and you know, they cut your wheel lock off, they cut your cable off, they can wheel your scooter down the road. Nobody thinks anything different, a guy just wheeling a scooter down the road. Now. If you just have the alarm on your scooter, your scooter is going to make noise as soon as somebody touches it, they move it, it's going to go off, it's going to, call, it's going to make noise, it's going to alert people that are around, that are up, to be able to see the scooter. And obviously somebody pushing a scooter that the lights are flashing and it's making a really loud noise, chances are that's not their scooter, they're stealing it from somebody else. So. That's why I like the alarm. It makes the noise, it alerts other people that, hey, this is not the owner of the scooter. Now, here's what I totally recommend though. Sometimes this doesn't make sense, but I, I really suggest this when it does make sense, don't use just one device. Don't use just one anti-theft device, use two. Okay, and here's what I mean by that. So, same scenario. It's nighttime, you got your scooter, you know, you got, a, you got your wheel lock on there, if you got your cable locked on there, it's on the gate, okay? Somebody goes and slips and they cut it, they can move it down the road. Now, if you have, one, the scooter alarm, and you also have a cable or a wheel lock, that person is going to have to basically cut the wheel lock off, they're gonna have to cut the cable without disrupting the scooter. If they disrupt the scooter, the thing's gonna go off. So obviously you could look outside, somebody could see it, somebody's trying to cut a wheel lock off, the scooter's going off. You know, they're not gonna have a good opportunity to steal your scooter that way. But let's say they do, let's say they're really slick. They go to cut the cable, they got the cable off of it, they start pushing the scooter, boom, the alarm goes off. You still got that noise, you still got that opportunity to, you know, to alert somebody. Now, all anti-theft devices, they're not a guarantee that your scooter is not going to get stolen, but what it does, it's a deterrent. I mean, obviously, if the thing's going off, nobody wants to be around it. Nobody wants to be around a scooter that's screaming and yelling and, and going crazy. And if you use two devices, it makes it that much harder for a person to try to steal your scooter. So this is Jeremy with J&J Power Sports. I hope you got some value out of this video. Again. Two devices when it makes sense. If you're somewhere and you can't lock it up on a tree or you can't do anything like that, you know, stick something through the wheel. You know, if you can use two devices, that is the best. But if you can only use one, again, I recommend the scooter alarm. So again, this is Jeremy Minow with JJ Power Sports. I hope you got some value out of this video. Um, if you did, if you need an alarm, we do sell them on the website. There's a link in here somewhere I'll put out there. But um, if you got some value out of this video, I'd love for you to comment below. You know, maybe share it on Facebook or something like that, or you know. Just make some comments on YouTube. So again, Jeremy up JJ Power Sports. Have a great day, and we'll see you in the next video. Take care. Hey, before you go, I want to make you this real, this real special offer. Okay, anybody that orders through the link below this video. Okay, I'll put a link down there. You go order your alarm. Anybody that orders an alarm through this blog post, through this link on the website, I'm gonna give you a free wheel lock. Okay, what it is? It's just a lock that goes on your brake. You stick it on there, it locks a scooter so the tire does not, cannot turn and it can't be driven. So that would be your second device that you could use. So anybody who orders, a, orders an alarm through this blog post, I'm gonna send you a free real wheel lock. Now, I don't have an unlimited supply of these things, so they're gonna be first come, first serve. So once I run out, I'm gonna be out. So if, if you're interested in an alarm and you want a wheel lock, you want that second device, go ahead and go to that link, order one through there, and I'll throw a wheel lock in there for you, free of charge, no shipping, no nothing. Nothing like that. So again, Jeremy Vento, JJ Power Sports. Have a great day. And if you have any questions, you know, make sure you just email us and uh, we'll be happy to answer any questions you have. Take care. Bye.